Hey, little man, what do we drive today? A schoolhouse. All right, Austin, you got your marker? Yeah. You ready to draw a schoolhouse? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna try and keep this nice and simple for young artists. Yeah. Okay, you ready to start? Mm-hmm. We're using a marker, but you guys at home don't have to. You could use a pencil or a crayon or something you feel more comfortable drawing with. Yeah. And we also have paper and we have some colored pencils. We have green, red, yellow, and blue. Let's put those off to the side and let's draw our schoolhouse first. Yeah. Okay, first step. We're gonna draw a straight line across the top of our paper. Can you do that? Yeah. All by yourself? You want points? I just want points. You want some points? Okay. Mm -hmm. One point there and then one point there. Straight across. Yes. Good job. Okay, now we're gonna draw two little lines straight down. One. Two. Then we're going to connect the bottom, and that's going to be a really long rectangle. And this is the top of our schoolhouse. Good. Now we're going to draw a line down here on this side. That's for one side of our schoolhouse. We'll start right there and come all the way. Let's come all the way down to there. Good. Job. Then we're gonna draw another line on this side and we want it to match. Can you draw another line that matches? Oh, that matches really well. Good job. Now let's connect the bottom from one side all the way over to the other side. So from here all the way over to there. Good. Now we're gonna draw the door. So we're gonna draw two lines right in the middle, straight up. So one like this, and one like that. So right here, we kinda wanna draw it a little small so that we have room for our windows. Can you connect those two dots? Yes, and then one on the other side. Good! And then we're gonna connect the top. Perfect, now let's put a doorknob on it. We're gonna draw a little circle. Good. Now let's practice drawing more straight lines. Okay. We're gonna draw a line that goes all the way over our door. Like that. Can you do that by yourself? Yes. Oh, one more line. Give me five, you did it. <laughs> now we're gonna draw two more squares and we're gonna draw them for the windows and we're gonna draw them right next to the doors. So let's draw an L first. We're gonna draw down and then over. Can you, do, can you draw that over here? Down, so from there to there, and then over. Good. Then we're gonna draw an upside down L to finish our square, or our box. You see the upside down L? And then over and connect it. Perfect. Now we're going to draw a box inside. So we're going to draw it right next. We'll draw another L right next to the first one. Practicing our squares and then over. You're concentrating. Good job. Now you can come over a little further, right to there. <laughs> Good. Now let's draw an upside down. <laughs> Now let's draw an upside down L. So we're gonna finish our box. So we'll go up and then over. Now let's split our window. We'll go right down the middle, like that. It's right down the middle of our window. And then we're gonna go across it. Is that a cool looking window? Mm -hmm. Okay, now we're gonna repeat those same steps on this side so we have another window. So let's draw the L first. L, big L, over, and then the upside down L. Oh, we can go a little faster because you know what we're gonna do next. Yeah. Okay, let's draw the box inside. Good, and then up and over. Perfect, you did it. Now let's split it right down the middle. 
and half, and then another time and half. All right, Austin, give me five. What are we missing? The roof. We are missing the roof. Let's draw a line up. So we'll draw from there up to there. Good, and we're gonna draw that same diagonal line on the other side. So we'll draw from here down to there. Good, and then we're gonna connect the top. Now we're drawing an old fashioned school and they used to have bells on the top and they would ring it to tell the kids to come into the school. So let's draw another box on top of our roof. So we'll draw a line, two lines up. Okay, right here, yeah. we'll draw one up and another one up. Okay. Good. job and then let's connect the top now let's practice what we did in the window let's draw another box inside this is a good lesson for drawing boxes all the way across now let's draw the roof and we're gonna draw a triangle on the top so we're gonna draw an upside down V we're gonna go up and then back down. Can you do that? An upside down V, so go from there to there. Good, and then down to the other side. Perfect, now let's draw the bell. Yeah. We're gonna draw an upside down U or rainbow line. Goes up and touches the top. Up, good, and then back down. <laughs> and then connect the bottom. Good, and then let's put the little bell inside. The little ringer. Perfect. What else should we add to our school? Um, the flag. A flag, okay. Let's draw a line straight out of the roof. Good, and we can put a circle on the top. And then let's draw a wavy line. Little wavy line. Yeah. Yes. Then we're gonna draw another wavy line that connects into that point. <laughs> yeah, I like your flag. It's really blowing in the wind. <laughs> Let's do one more thing. Let's add a sign on our schoolhouse and write school on it. Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna do another box right here, and we'll fast forward, but you guys at home can get a little help from your parents or from a teacher. Yeah. A really small L. Oh, you fit it in, you did it. <laughs> Now you guys at home can pause the video if you want to match what we drew. We just did another box or rectangle and then we wrote school in the middle. S-C-H-O-O-L. What does that spell? School. School. Okay, now let's draw the sidewalk going to the door. So let's draw two lines coming down for the sidewalk. Good, and then let's put Let's put some bushes on the side. So we're gonna draw a popcorn shape on the side. Like that? That looks like do... they're, on the, they're on the house. Yeah, they are. They're kind of stuck to the house, huh? You could draw them right here next to the school. Good job. Okay, now let's put our markers off to the side and then let's get our colors. And I forgot we need one other color. We're gonna use brown for the roof. You ready to fast forward? Yeah. Okay, let's do it right, right now. now. Awesome, man. You did a great job on your schoolhouse. Did you have fun? Yeah. You promise? Yeah. Now, you guys at home can pause the video right now to match the coloring that we did. We did red on the school, green on the, the bushes and the grass, 
blue on the windows and also on the, what's this called? Flag. Flag and then yellow on, what? The bell. Yes, the bell and the? Doorknob. Doorknob. And then we did brown on the door and the? Roof. The roof. What's the most important thing when you're doing art? It's your hair. Fun. Yes, to have fun. We hope you guys had a lot of fun following along with us. Remember, if we ever went too fast, you could always pause the video. Pause the video. <laughs> <Plaza> the video. <laughs> we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Yes.